the current sentiment among employees, and that's what matters most here, is that the sentiment is about change and it's been building for some time. We found that 58% of Australian organizations reported having turnover issues, while almost 18% of those indicated that those issues were becoming increasingly serious or a problem for the business. I do think that talent movement is a good thing for skills and infusion across the industry and, and across multiple industries. However, that demand is having an impact on retention and it's something that MBN has to acknowledge and plan for both in our short and long term. So that lost incidental learning, the discussion you might have when you go and grab a coffee together, uh, the discussion you have in the interim time between meetings in the office, that's gone. And so for that development to be re-established is going to be important. So even offering full flexibility, being very conscious about development opportunities. Tighter employment markets have given two things. One, greater negotiation ability for individuals in the market and yeah, and whether that salary, bonus, benefits really depends what's important to the individuals. Four, shortened times for people to find a new role. So we're seeing those decrease in some instances by months. It's, a, it's an employee's workplace. Um, uh, and uh, is a greater level of increase in participation in goal setting and, and improved communication. And I think leaders who get on the front foot of getting their team members involved in goal setting as opposed to telling them what the goal is um, and you know, improving their levels of feedback and the like uh, because they may not be in the office as much or they may be in different locations, again, are going to build better and longer and deeper levels of trust and bonds to the organisation. It's not so much going to be about um, you know, an employer of choice, I don't think, or, you know, great places to work and things like that. I really think it's going to be a destination of choice and for, for employees. And I think people are going to make a choice around, is this a destination I want to be at? Um, taking into account all that's in front of me, not just pay and my boss and things like that, but things such as, do I get balance? Um, is this psychologically safe uh, and the like? When I think of talent, I, you know, for me, I think about choice. It's really important that each individual has that. It's very personal. We want people to get together and connect for those really key moments that matter. I think many of us who are in the space of HR and have always believed that valuing the perspectives of our employees, creating diverse workplaces, creating places that our employees love to come to, we're, we're quite excited by the fact that, if anything, this topic spurs that kind of thinking and really brings it to the fore.